Another big story out of Washington. It's day four of the government shutdown, but that's not stopping veterans from around the country from taking a patriotic pilgrimage. Ashley Moser is live from Toledo Express Airport with more on a local vet group pushing forward with their own trip. Ashley. And at many national parks and monuments remain closed today, but one local veteran is leaving from this airport next Wednesday to visit the Korean Memorial in Washington, D.C., despite facing a trespassing arrest. Military veterans continue to visit the World uh, the War II Memorial site, even though it's technically closed. The National Park Service says it will allow the Honor Flight of Northwest Ohio to visit, but hasn't commented about the other war sites. But for one veteran, Walt Churchill, who's scheduled to visit the memorial in the Capitol next week, plans haven't changed. Walt says his actions have earned him the right to freely visit a place that he honors his service. Probably uh, stand in the wrong place if you're standing in front of somebody that has made the, po the monument possible. Some of these guys that are involved in closing the monuments were never in the service, so they've had a free ride. So, Annette, there's still a possibility of legal action towards these veterans, but Churchill says that's a chance he's willing to take. Live from the Toledo Express Airport, this is Ashley Moser for WNWO Today. Back to you.